English learners and welcome to this video. From today, I will be starting a new series in which we will read together. Yes, in this site, I will be showing you the clips and we will read it. And make sure of the pronunciation, your reading, speed, everything. This video is specially for the beginners. So without any further ado, let's get started. All right, let's get started. And Listen to the pronunciation. If the word is complicated, then I will repeat it pronunciation twice or thrice also. Let's start. I have a great job. I study crocodiles. I study crocodiles. How it goes? Crocodiles. Okay. It's an important job. Important job. Let me explain why. Okay. Here in Australia. 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 Here in Australia, we have a lot of crocodiles. But sometimes the crocodiles are sick. But sometimes the crocodiles are sick. Sick. Okay. I want to know why. So this is someone who is telling about his work in Australia. What he do? He is studying for crocodiles. Okay. Now let's further move. I want to know why. I study the food the crocodiles eat. I repeat again. I study the food the crocodiles eat. I also learn how fast they grow and where they live. Okay. I uh, where I was? Yeah. I study the food crocodiles eat. I also learn how fast they grow, where they live. Okay. How do I do this? I repeat again. How do I do this? It means, ye mein kaise karta hu, right? It means that the person is studying that what crocodiles eat, where do they live, and these things, how he do. Okay. How do he do? How do how do we find these kinds of answers? Okay, so this he is telling us. How do I do this? Well, in the morning, I take my camera and I watch the crocodiles in the river. 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 I take photos. Okay, sometimes I take photos. Sometimes the crocodiles eat toads. Pronunciation of this is Toads. Okay. Now don't take two. Toads. It is the incorrect. I have listened to many speakers who say it's like this. Toads. No. It's toads. Okay. Toads. I hope you got it. Some toads make them sick and they die. I want to help the crocodiles. Okay. So here we have finished our first part. I hope uh you got something to learn the pronunciation of crocodiles, toads, and many. Now we will be starting our second part. So this was our first one, first page of the reading. Now I'm moving towards the second chapter. Okay, so this is our second chapter. Believe it or not. I taste ice cream for my job. Okay. Yes, it's a dream job, but it's also difficult. Difficult. Difficult means something which is complicated. I work at a big ice cream company. 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 Every day I taste lots of different flavors three times each. Okay. He is saying that every day because he is working in an ice cream company. So he says I taste lots of different flavors three times each it means like suppose uh, there is a flavor called vanilla so he will taste that flavor for the three times to check that how it is okay what is that well i taste little of the ice cream cream we make in the morning afternoon at night afternoon afternoon at night that's way that Way. It's sorry. Uh, before this I pronounce it like that. But it's not that. It's that way. That way. 
I know that all the ice cream is good. I use my eyes first. I use my eyes first. Does the ice cream look nice? Does the ice cream look nice? Then there is a question mark. Then I taste the ice cream with a spoon. With a spoon. Okay. So this is the spoon. Does it taste fresh and sweet? Does it taste fresh? Fresh and sweet. Sweet. Okay. Then I spit it out. Yes, I really spit it out. Then at last he says, what he says at last, then I spit it out. Spit means to throw something out of your mind like this. It's called spit. Okay. He says that I taste it, then I spit it out. Okay. Spit. In Hindi it means thukna. Spit. This. Okay. Spit. Spit. I hope you got the pronunciation. Okay. Then I spit it out. Yes. I really spit it out. Then everyone will be shocked now that wow, you are spitting the ice cream. So that's why I'm saying in the last, yes, I spit it out. Hope this video helps to you. So this was my first video with reading practice. If you have any doubt related to anything, then let me in the comment section below. I will be meeting you in the next part of reading practice. Hare Krishna. Bye.